Hey, how's it going? Checking in with updates for today. And there are updates. Um, not in the sense of like mega progress being made with people coming to me and booking me and all of those things. But I've just been on a day long course with the lovely Maria Franzoni and Mary Tilson. I've done a couple of their courses over the, the course of the last, I think, two years. I think I went to one in January, which was in person in London. That was 20. 20 so last January and then I did their speaking in a different world course which was a I think a 12 week course or a 10 week course whatever uh back end of the last year and that was really useful as well and uh, each time I go and spend time working with these ladies things just feel like they're stepping up just another another notch um and t today was no exception it was all about prospecting which is something that I've been really really terrible at and I've sat here doing these videos and talking about some of the challenges I've got with people not getting back to me or with um, being ghosted or or um, just not knowing who to contact. That's been the biggest challenge, like who do I contact? And it's been a real revelation to actually how much potential I already have in my list of contacts on LinkedIn, on my email list, um, other networks that I'm in. And, um, and to actually have a system as well now to approach them and to share with them some of the things that I'm doing and try and get in front of the right person. So even though they might not be the right person, actually asking who I would need to speak to. And it sort of twisted things around slightly from my approach that uh, I had had previously, which essentially was to try and um, position my training programs, my resilience masterclasses, my well-being um, workshops, and actually moving it more towards conferences and existing events and so not just conferences but that's very very something that's very very in, of interest to me um in fact that way back at the beginning of doing these videos almost four years ago the whole thing was about uh in my mind i think i had this idea of being a, a conference keynote speaker so sort i of moved away from that as being the most important thing but uh because i do love doing the training but it is still something that when I was up in Chester a few weeks ago during that conference keynote, just absolutely love doing it. So I do want to be doing that. But um, now I feel like I have a little bit more of a plan. So the, the proof of the pudding will be in the eating. It's all about how this actually plays out. And of course, there's work that I need to do, a lot of work that I need to do um, to actually make this happen. But I do feel like I've got a bit more of a system now. Um, a bit more of a, a kind of a list of tasks, things that I just need to get done, um, phone calls that I need to make, emails, messages that I need to be written, um, a bit more of a process. And also one of the things that I'm also particularly bad at, though I don't think that's an unusual thing, is to be tracking these leads as well, tracking people who I do get in touch with and um, looking at other events that are go that are going on out there and then 12 months down the line getting in touch with them and saying hey look I know you have an event coming up um, no I'm a speaker on this this and this so there's there's a ton of stuff it was literally it was a full day course what 9 30 till about we just finished about five minutes ago and uh, so yeah a lot of content and it was very practical as well so it's a good course and I feel like I'm I'm work to do but more more focus much more focus now so there we go i'm a bit tired now though as well so i'm going to leave that there for today thanks for watching thanks for listening give it a like subscribe to the channel and check back in again tomorrow for another daily update bye for now